I, I believe uh, we were created to, to live off the land. The land has everything to do with the life of our people. We find peace out here. There's a couple times that I wanted, I wanted to take my life. I... Like I know a lot of people want me to be good and to do good and... But I also want to be a father to these kids so I can, you know, reach out to them and try to help them out. We were trying to find a way to uh, address some of their needs, some of their dreams and hopes. Well, I was encouraging them just to keep going, you know, there's something more out there for you, you know, you have to look for it, you have to find it. Maybe if we could take the youth out to the land. A hunting, a small game like ptarmigan, a big game like moose and caribou. If we took them back to the land base and to, you know, how our people lived, maybe that would help. To come out here was uh, just to get a breather from life. First I wasn't going to come. I was too afraid to be like, oh, she's going on a trip, so she must, there must be something wrong with her. Some people's got some troubles in their lives and stuff, and just to come out here and forget about everything that's back home. When you're out there, it's somehow the stillness, the beauty just is so healing spotted the uh, caribou because I couldn't see them from far. So as soon as I saw them, I was like, oh, I gotta kill them. I had the gun and I was aiming and I shot one. Then he spots another one and then I aimed for the other one and I shot it. And she was so proud. She, we could just literally see uh, a transformation you know, take place before our very eyes. It's kind of like cleansing yourself out here. I saw the youth uh, talking to each other. I saw them cry together. I saw them hug together. I saw them laugh together. But there is something good in each and every one of them. So I really want them to, to find out what, what it is that you know God has put them on this earth for. There's a lot of these uh, symbols of life. Take a broken old piece of mosquito that's run down, forgotten, you know, thrown aside, and yet it can be put back together and it can run. I don't know, I just feel better. I feel more positive now. I'm really glad that I know, I know my culture and my tradition. You know, we are dealing with the very hard issue, but joy. I pray for healing to my people. We're here to support you. We're here to, you know, to journey with you. You're not alone. Makes me feel proud of myself. I'm so proud of her. Very proud. I had a great time in the bus and it was quiet and peace. Now imagine, imagine if something like this could start right across town. I, I think this, you know, we could change our nation.